hi everyone welcome back to my channel today's video as you can hopefully tell is the tutorial it's how to get this gold and bronze smoky eye and a matte red lip i think that this look is just perfect for christmas and parties and stuff coming up towards christmas so, so if you want to see how to recreate this look then just keep on watching Okay, so first things first, I'm going to start off with primer and I'm going to use the Ilamasca Satin Primer with a 103 Defined Buffer from Zoeva. This is a really good brush. I'm going to just apply this to my face. This is a really nice primer actually. Then once that is all nicely blended in, I'm going to use the Charlotte Tilbury Magic Foundation. I'm just going to use a few pumps of this on the same brush and I'm just going to blend it in. On camera I look like a ghost, my lighting is not helping me. I am pale but not that pale. Um, so I'm going to go in with my Collection Lasting Perfection Concealer underneath my eyes. This is in Fair One and just literally pop this underneath my eye for that. Again, I'm gonna just use the same brush. Just literally blend it in. I'm gonna powder using the MAC Studio Care Bend Pressed Powder. This is in the shade Light. Press it in. It's a really nice one, actually. Next, I'm gonna contour using Hoola by Benefit. I love this, I've had this for ages and I'm just using a Real Techniques contour brush next I'm going to go in with blush and I'm going to use the Dior blush in Brown Millie I think it is yeah number 566 Brown Millie I love this blusher I'm just going to apply that with a fluffy brush as I call them a fluffy brush Just in circular motions, heading towards the hairline. And I'm going to highlight using MAC Soft and Gentle Mineralized Skin Finish. I love this. Love. Amazing. Next on to eyebrows and I'm going to use a mixture of two different products. I'm going to use the Charlotte Tilbury Brow Lift Pencil. I'm sure this is in the shade Brooke S. I've mentioned it a million times. I'm also going to use MAC Dirty Blonde Fluid Line um, for my eyebrows. So I'm going to start off with the Charlotte Tilbury Brow Pencil. And the reason I'm using two is because I hardly have any of this left. Um, so I'm just going to do the outline of my brows in this and then I'm going to fill them in with the MAC Fluid Line. eyebrows done they have turned out a lot thicker than I would normally do them that's because I use the MAC fluid line which is as you can see really strong um, normally I just use the Charlotte Tilbury pencil but um, yeah if you're after thick brows or if you have naturally thick brows and you want a good product MAC fluid lines next is eyes and I'm going to use the MAC warm neutral palette thing. and I'm going to use amber lights and I'm just going to apply this all over the lid And then I'm just going to blend that out. I'm going to use a bit of Divine Decadence, which is this one here. Um, and I'm going to just use that in the crease with the brush that I used to blend out, which is a 221 Lux Soft Crease Brush by Zoeva. Just softly blending it in. Then I'm going to use the MAC Black Track Fluid Line. This is basically black gel eyeliner with a Zoeva 317 wing liner brush. As you can probably tell, I love Zoeva brushes. And I'm just going to create a slight wing eyeliner on my lid.
So I'm going to just do the same on the other eye. And that's done. I'm going to use my, I've realised that I've used a lot of MAC products in this video and I didn't mean to, but I'm going to use the MAC Horton Naughty Lash Mascara. It's a really nice mascara, I have to say. And I'm going to use the thicker wand because it comes with two wands. I'm going to use the Estate Lauder Pure Colour Eye Pencil. I think this is in like black and black. This is amazing. Like it is so dark. I used to use the Soap and Glory one. Um, and I'm literally like down to that much. But it's so black and so pigmented. And I love that. But this one is even better. If you're looking for a really pigmented black eyeliner, this is the one. This is the one. I mean, look at that. Amazing. I love it. Then onto falsies. I'm going to use these really natural ones from Red Cherry. They are the Red Cherry Dell lashes. As you can see, they're really natural. Um, so I thought I would give those a go. So I'm going to just pop a bit of duo eyelash glue. The best eyelash glue, to be honest. But it just stinks. I'm going to pop that on the back of my hand. Tweezers in the other hand in case you don't know how to apply them. Take them off the packaging, so you've got them like that. I mean, you can see how natural they are. They're like nothing to them. Drag it through the glue. Sit them on top in the middle like that. Pull the one end down, and then pull the other end down. Ta-da! Do the same with the other one. And the glue dries clear as well so don't worry make sure you just push them down afterwards like this one's more or less dry apart from a tiny bit there but they dry really quickly last steps lips and i'm going to use the charlotte tilbury lip cheat crazy in love this is amazing i love this one um so i'm just going to line my lips and fill my lips in with this And on top of that, I'm going to use MAC Ruby Woo. This is slightly lighter than the Crazy Lab lip liner I've used, but that's what I want. Um, and they're both matte. And that is the end of this week's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you have any specific makeup tutorials that you would like to see, then please leave them in the comment section below. All of my social media links are in the description box below as always. Make sure to subscribe for more videos and I will see you very soon for another video.